Sail Sharks travel to fellow strugglers London Irish with both sides eager to earn a win that would help guarantee their place in the Aviva Premiership next season. And it was London Irish who opened the scoring after just two minutes when centre Guy Armitage bundled his way over from close range following a powerful burst through the sail midfield by Silosi Tani Fackenbau with Tom Homer adding the extras. Nick McLeod had got Sale on the board with his first penalty, but Irish stretched the lead once more when prop Halani Aulika picked up from the base of a ruck and brushed off the despairing tackle of Charlie Amesbury to score his fourth try of the season. Homer was again successful with his conversion before Sale's first meaningful attack of the game produced a yellow card for Irish hooker David Pace, who was deemed to be slowing the ball down illegally at the breakdown. The Sharks elected to kick for the corner rather than going for the posts and immediately made their man advantage tell, with Henry Thomas crossing from close range. The visitors then moved into the lead six minutes later when quick hands released Mark Cueto, who crossed for his 77th Premiership try. But Sales' lead was not to last, as Tom Homer landed two long-range kicks to put the home side 2015 up, with half-time approaching. Then, with the final play of the half, Cameron Shepherd was able to create the space to send Kernan Mile over in the corner, with McLeod adding the extras to put Sale ahead at the break for the first time this season. McLeod had already stretched Sale's lead to five before James Gaskell spun his way through the Irish defence to earn Sale their first try bonus of the season. The conversion was missed, but Sale was suddenly ten points ahead. But Irish refused to let go. Max Laheith became the seventh player to get his name on the score sheet when he was driven over from short range before Tom Homer added his third penalty of the game to tie the scores at 30 all and then on 65 minutes kicked his team back into the lead. With time ticking down, it looked like Irish might hold on for the win. But when referee Greg Garner harshly penalised Irish for not rolling away at the breakdown, Nick McLeod kept a cool head to land the kick and earn his side a share of the spoils and heap further pressure on London Welsh at the foot of the table.